Today near the beach house, uh, with the help of Professor Hoddy, I found a, um, a few helmet crabs. And these are um, probably endangered species, but they're not reg uh, registered as such. They have no natural predators except for man. And the reason why uh, humans kill them is because they have this long spike here at the back. Hold on, maybe if I uh, touch his spike he'll move it. Um, this spike here. And this, apparently, if you get uh, spiked with that, you can die of shock. Because it's rather large. Look, I'm going to pick this guy up now, and he's going to wave his spike at me. Ah. Ah. There, and they've got their... Um, they're not like other crabs. They've got lots and lots of... Um, this is waving his spike. He's upside down now. He's annoyed. Uh, he's got lots and lots of uh, scissors in there. And uh, his closest relative is probably a spider. Uh, and they've been around since the dinosaurs, so they say a helmet crab and apparently in America they're using them for uh, uh, some kind of treatment or um, way of detecting cancer due to the fact that I don't know I don't know why and they uh, well, the other thing is that they pair for life but this guy is so um, scared that he's uh, thinking of leaving his wife so I have to put him back with his wife and this is his wife here and you can see that there are marks on the back of her shell where he's been clamped on there for a long time and normally they stake it together ah yes he's clamped back on and this is another uh, lady. He keeps on wanting to leave his wife, which is rather unfortunate. Um, and this is another lady, even bigger. And you can see from the marks on her back that uh, she used to have a husband who was with her for a considerable amount of time, but now no longer with her, unfortunately, uh, when we found her, she was on her own. And uh, she must be at least 10 years old, apparently, because they, they take 10 years to be that size. And here's a little one here, and this one's uh, two or three years old, apparently. And you can see, uh, you can find them by the fact that they leave uh, kind of distinctive tracks in the sand. Uh, very strange, yeah. But come to Japan and you can see helmet crabs. Well, not, not for much longer it seems, but uh, we were lucky today.